Hi, welcome to this tutorial. This is Teacher Raya from Elimo Hubs Math. In this session, we are going to solve question 12a from Nectar Form 4 2019 math paper. So the question is from the topic Earth as a sphere. So let's read quite the question then. A sheep sails from Pemba with this location 4.5 degrees south, 39 point five degrees east to Dar es Salaam seven point five degrees south thirty nine point five degrees east if it leaves Pemba at eleven thirty AM and arrive in Dar es Salaam one thirty PM use pi equal to this radius of the earth equals to this find the speed of the shape it in kilometers per hour so we are after speed and what do we know about speed so speed is distance over time. Do we have distance? No, we don't have distance. Do we have time? Yes, it left 11.30 a.m. and it arrived at 1.30 p.m. So that is two hours. So time is going to be equal to two hours. So our problem is a distance. Now let's use the uh, geographical locations here to find distance. Now if you notice, we have the same uh, longitude there. Uh, this uh, ship travel on the same longitude, which is 39.5 degrees. I'm going to draw these uh, positions in. So the first one, 4.5 degrees south. This is our zero degrees. So south is going down. And let's say 4.5 is somewhere here. So this is 4.5 degrees south. I'm going to draw my uh, latitude here. So this is my first location, which is Pemba. Right, and then it went to Dar es Salaam at 7.5 degrees south. Okay, so let's just use a different color for that one. So 7.5, let's say it's just there. And this is just for demonstration purpose because we know that is more than 7.5 from the um, equator. I'm just showing you what it may look like. And I'm leaving a lot of space in between. So this is Dar es Salaam then. And it traveled on the same long longitude, which is 39.5 degrees east. So let's put that in green. Uh, east is on this side. So let's just say uh, it, this one here. This is 39.5 degrees east. Okay, so this is where the journey started, Pemba. And this is where the journey uh, ended, Dar es Salaam. So we need the distance from there to there. What do we need, right? So if you remember the formula for distance is the proportion, which is this alpha by 360 degrees, time the, the formula for the circumference. So two times pi times the radius. Now, which radius do we need? We're dealing with distance along grid circle here. So that means we need the radius of the earth, okay? So this means D, what will be alpha? Well, we always draw this sector. Okay, so center of the earth is there. Connect the two locations there. And you need this uh, angle here. And the distance you need is this one here. So I'm going to take this sector out so you can see. This sector look like this. This is the distance that we need. This is Pemba, this is Dar es Salaam. So the position of Pemba is 4.5 degrees south. This one is 7.5 degrees uh, south. It's in the same hemisphere. So we're going to find the difference between the two, which is three degrees. So the angle that you need alpha is a three. So now we're just going to substitute that in as three over 360 times two. And we're told to use pi as 22 over seven and the radius of the earth as 6370. If you calculate this, you will get 333.67 kilometers. All right, so now we have our distance. We can go ahead and find speed. So speed is distance over time, as I said here. So distance is 333.67. 
and time is two hours divided by two and give you one hundred and sixty six point eight four kilometers per hour okay so this this is the answer for this question thank you for visiting and bye for now